Excuse me, Lynette, I'm so sorry. We're going to go right now. This is breaking news. Megan Knight, I am so sorry for that. I had my, uh, my directions mixed up. Megan Knight on the scene right now. Breaking news, a train accident in South Baltimore. Megan, please. Hey there, good morning. Yeah, we are live here at the corner of Hollins Ferry Road and South Packer Street uh, on the scene of a deadly train versus car accident. Uh, this is where the accident took place at this crossing guard. However, you really can't see uh, the full impact of this accident uh, because we're told uh, by some firefighters on the scene right here that the car, when hit by the train, was pushed down the tracks about a quarter mile or so, which uh, unfortunately we can't see because of all the brush there. Uh, this accident happening just before 7 o'clock this morning, again, at the uh, Hollins Ferry Road, South Packer Street. Police have got this all blocked off, so if this is your uh, normal commuter, you're headed down this way, you're probably going to want to find an alternate route because you cannot get past this area. Uh, right now, not too sure what happened leading up to this crash. Not sure if the crossing guards weren't working properly, um, but we are going to work and get you that information. We can tell you that uh, there were two people in the car. One person died at the scene. The second person has been taken to the hospital. Um, but again, you know, this area all blocked off right now. We still got an active scene going on here. Police working to determine the cause. The trains still on the tracks. Uh, I can't really see because once again, trains a little bit down the tracks about a quarter mile. We are being told though by MTA, the Camden line has been suspended. So passengers are being told to take the Penn line instead. Once again, the Camden line has been suspended. So passengers uh, using Mark trains are going to want to take uh, the pen line instead. Unfortunately, we don't really have a whole lot of information other than the fact that one person has died, another person seriously hurt. We, of course, will be talking with MTA, talking with police, and as soon as we get you more information, we'll, of course, bring that to you. You can also follow us on Twitter for the latest breaking news at ABC2 News. Charlie, back to you.